Hello, this is Joette with BloomCoach.com, and I am delighted that you're here. If you're live, you're joining me on January 1st of 2019 to ring in the new year because you're serious about taking steps in this new year to make your balloon business dreams reality. And I am so glad that you're taking time out of your day to join me. So welcome. We have people from across the United States, Canada and Belgium even with us today live. So I'm so glad you're here. For those of you who are joining me live, please use the chat box to let me know you're here and where you're joining us from. And during the presentation, you can ask questions there, participate in the conversation. And at the end of the presentation, I will open up for Q&A. So I'm glad you're here. If you're watching the replay, no matter what year it is when you watch this replay, I want you to know that these three basic steps are things that you can do at any time to make your business dreams reality. So just to say hello for those of you who don't know me, my name is Joette Giardina. I've been in the balloon industry full time since 2003 with a business in Lakeland, Florida, right between Tampa and Orlando. It was called Party People Events. And um, it was Party People Celebration Company back when I owned it. And in 2015, I took off on my dreams because so many people were asking me how I grew my business that I took a leap of faith. And when Jonathan Gerber asked me if I would sell my business to him, I did. And so in 2015, I became the marketing director for Party People Events. So I'm still part of this growing dynamic team that at the end of 2000. 18 did over six hundred thousand dollars in sales i love being a part of a big team it's fun and i get to live my dream of being balloon and helping balloon professionals around the world be inspired and get connected to training to help you take your business to the next level on this slide some of my dreams came reality in 2018. the picture on the left is a group of individuals we had over 75 balloon professionals and a team of staff come together in orlando for promotions and profits retreat and we did four style photo shoots and this was at the end of the night of our new year's eve style shoot it was so much fun having the balloon drops come down the balloons explode flutter fetty going everywhere and just a great time if you have never been to an event with balloon professionals just to let you all know we know how to rock the dance floor and have a good time. So I wanted to give you a teeny bit of history that that is how I am, where I am, and why I'm sharing this information with you. And Will Brown is telling me that he loved the promotions and profits training. And I am so glad that you were there with us. Um, it was a very fun event. What I put on with my hands-on events is different and dynamic compared to other things that are in the industry. And we keep it as a small group so that you can have an intimate time to learn how to take your business to the next level. So let's get started. I have a question for you. Do you currently write down your goals? So right now, those who are live, just quick yes or no. Do you currently write down your goals? Type it in for me so I know. All right, we've got a yes, a no, a yes, a yes. <laughs> no, yay, no. All right, no, no. Keep on going, no, yes. <laughs> Some of them, no, but I'll start. Awesome, thank you, Angela. Nope, I love it. Thank you so much for being honest. Um, and then um, Bridgette saying has it for 2019 yet. Here's the thing. What I want to know is when you look back at last year, did you achieve the things you wanted to? So let's think about that for a second. Look back on your year last year, and when you think about that year, did you achieve the things you wanted to? So answer could be yes, no, some of them. All right, so we've got some, we've got no, <laughs> um, some of them. All right, great, thanks for being honest. You know what, that's reality. Typically, we don't always achieve everything that we set out to do, but there are systems and things that we can put in place so that we can be more successful. All right, so we've got people telling me that they had um, their sales grew, which was a plus, but not all the other goals were created. Um, people had some things that happened and some did not achieve, they had hard times. And 
boy, do I understand hard times. <laughs> um, and we all go through them. Life is a journey. And sometimes things are going to go exactly the way we had planned. And other times, not so much. So do you have new things that you want to make reality in the next year? So right now, with the way your life is, are there things that you want to make a reality for your next year? Absolutely. Yes. Awesome. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Then you guys are in the right place. Thank you so much for participating in these questions. I love it because you're in the right, pli right place to get things going because it's the first day of the year. Or again, if you're watching this replay later, anytime you take action on these steps, you will see improvement. So this is Paris. Well, in Orlando, it was Paris. It was prom as part of Promotions and Profits Retreat. This was a dream of mine that I would bring balloon professionals from around the world together with other balloon professionals who had dynamic growing companies that would share their insights with others that would be supported by manufacturers in the balloon industry to create dynamic professional photography to help you sell your business. That goal was set and 75 people joined me in Orlando to make this happen along with our amazing staff. So, the number one thing we're going to talk about, in case you didn't catch on to it by the questions, is our number one tip is to write down your goals. Okay, so all those people who are honest and told me, no, 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 that you do not write down your goals currently, studies show we are 42% more likely to have goals happen if we write them down. Okay, this sounds really simple. This is something that is not new. This is not something that I created whatsoever. It's just something that I follow. Studies show that we are 42% more likely to have goals happen if we write them down. So grab a piece of paper and start writing. So right now, if there are things off the top of your head you know that you want to accomplish in 2019, grab you a notebook, get some paper out, piece of envelope, whatever you got, and write some of those things down today. And then you need to look at them daily, okay? I have my vision board that sits right here next to me at my computer every day. And on the back of them, I have written all my numbers of how many sales I wanna have, what um, objectives I want to create for the next year. They're right here, always for me to see. And I'm gonna be making new ones on Sunday, January 6th with those who are joining me for our goal setting for 2016. So write down your goals and look at them daily. Can you do that? I'm asking for a commitment. <laughs> Can you do me that where you're serious about your business and in 2019, write down your goals and look at them daily? It's not hard, it's something that's free and nobody can stop you from doing it except for you, all right? So, this was what the facial expression was of the professional models who were hired to come in the doors as a bride and groom for our photo shoot for the wedding. This beautiful organic arch was created under the guides of Cody Williams from um, Cody's Red Balloon in Texas. He was one of our instructors that added all the beautiful floral to this, along with creating it during the hands-on workshop of Promotions and Profits. I'm bringing this up because it was a goal I wrote down. I wrote down that we would have this event and that I would have models there and I would have a professional photographer to create this style photo shoot. Style photo shoots are something anybody in the industry can create in your own hometown with your balloons and the vendors that you know. These models were shocked as they walked in the door and saw the space. They loved it. And that visual of them being happy and the words that they said was such a huge payoff for going after the goal of doing a styled photo shoot and creating this beautiful balloon decor. And John is telling me that it was fun to build that with everyone. All right, and here's the thing. This is something that you can do. If that's a goal of yours that you wanna have more wedding decor in your balloon industry, um, in your area, then create beautiful decor get photos of it and market it. Or if you came to Promotions of Profits, you now have all these photos to sell with. All right, so number two for your three steps for 
this next year is to set up your support team. All right, if you wanna make your balloon business goals a reality, you have to set up a support team. And I know this is one where a lot of people struggle because we don't like to admit that we need help. But as human beings, we were created to work in conjunction with others. We were created to live life together and not be isolated. So what I want you to look at, number one, is personally, who is that go-to support that you have that is a positive, uplifting person? Okay, now are you listening to me? Because it's got two parts. <laughs> you need a go-to person, but that go-to person needs to be positive. And unfortunately, in our world, there are a lot of people who've had bad life experiences and choose to go through every day looking at things in a negative light. They're the ones that gossip first. They're the ones that tell you all the bad news. They're the ones that watch TV 24 seven and just look at the negative. So I am encouraging you, if you happen to have a circle of people that are in your life that are negative, Debbie Downers, get rid of them. Not that you have to never talk to them again, but don't spend the majority of your time with them because the five people that you spend your time with the most are who shape you. And I am so blessed to have the most amazing support team and tribe of people that surround me. And I had to work at that. I used to have a lot of Debbie Downers and I stepped away from that and I worked hard at building relationships with people who are like-minded, positive, and going for their goals. So there is not enough time in life to be drugged down by negative people and drama. Life is too short, okay? My dad passed away in January. That's how I started 2018, was being there for my dad's last 10 days on the planet. And the number one thing that I was taught by that experience early on in 2018 is life is short and that you don't get a do-over. <laughs> and so make it positive, okay? Clean up your friends and your Facebook feeds and focus on the positive. Sorry, I got something. I don't even understand all the Facebook algorithms, okay? One of the things that I noticed is recently I've been getting inundated with a bunch of posts from people I honestly don't know. And I do know that I do moderate three online Facebook groups, so that puts me in connection with a lot more people. But what I realized that these are people that I haven't met and sat down and had dinner with, or a meal, or met at a training, or had really great online communication with. This is just some random person out in the world. They don't need to be in my main feed. Okay, it doesn't mean that I'm unfriending them, but what I'm doing is I'm going onto Facebook, I'm clicking that little button that says unfollow. And what that means is now it allows for my Facebook feed to be the people that I really want to share my life with, my friends, my family, the people that I have met through all the wonderful events that I've gone to. And I want those people who are positive to fill my feed. And those that are negative and always are bashing other people, I've unfollowed them, okay? So, I challenge you to do the same thing when you're supporting up your support, sorry, setting up your support system. Part of it is all this information that comes into our brain every day, we want it to be positive information. We want it to be uplifting. So when you take control of what's coming into your life, it makes a huge difference. And the other part about that on the personal level is I don't watch the news. I have, we no longer have regular TV and I don't watch the news. If there's something important happening in the world, I know that it'll show up on my Facebook feed or that a friend will send me a message of, hey, have you heard about this? I realized when my father was passing away that he spent all day with the news channels on, just repetitive, the exact same information over and over and over again. And it just was negative and yucky. And I'm like, I don't want to live that way. I don't want to hear all that. I want to live in the moment with positive things and the things that I can change and affect. So that's just a little extra tip. So another support team that you need to set up is professionally. Who helps you run your business? Do you have a bookkeeper? You can either find somebody locally or you can actually do it virtually. And if you need help on that, I have a blog on it um, that was on bookkeeping. And so you just go to my homepage at bloomcoach.com under the search click in bookkeeper and you will have information about QuickBooks Online and how that works. And you can either do it yourself or hire Brittany as your virtual person. 
get a virtual assistant possibly to answer the phones for you certain times a day. If your phone's ringing so much that you don't have time to answer it, then have somebody else do it. You can get a marketing person. I'm Jonathan Gerber's marketing person. I work 10 hours a week for him marketing, doing things on Facebook, going to networking events. A lot of people tell me that they struggle with how to um, go to a networking event and what to say, that it's not their best thing to do, or that they struggle in answering the phone. All these different things, you can find people even on a part-time job to do it. Um, all right, and this is a great one person's letting me know that she has a business background and she does all of her own um, bookkeeping but needs help in marketing. That's great. And one of the things that Jonathan um, Gerber, the owner of Party People Events, always says is that he works in his strengths and he hires his weaknesses. He does not enjoy going to networking events, um, but he does enjoy running a business. He enjoys employing other people and helping them have money. He enjoys growing a team and he loves doing balloon decor. So he grows a team to do that. And he trusts other people to answer the phone and put out the quotes and be a part of his team. So that's something that I really encourage you to look at. What are your weaknesses and what are you not so good at? All right. Um, let's see. The, whoops. That went wrong. Sorry, guys. <laughs> so balloon inflators. When you're looking at expanding your business, anybody can blow up a balloon and size a balloon. You just have to train them right or have high speed and digital equipment like I always have. Um, you can have crew members. People just to open the door and help you get through an event quicker. You can have a takedown crew that we call them the party crashers now. <laughs> and our party crashers go out at the end of the night and go take everything down from the day because the crew that set it all up is tired. You can get a mentor or a coach. There are so many business coaches in the world. You can have somebody that's online. You can have somebody that's in person um, in the city you live or ballooncoach.com is available for you. You also need to set up a support system with tools to run your business efficiently. Great tools for you to look at is QuickBooks Online, Google Calendar, and an, creating an operations manual for your business systems to do things efficiently and train your staff. I'm gonna say that one one more time because this is an area people really struggle in. Creating an operations manual for your business systems to do things efficiently and be able to train staff. Even if you are brand new to the industry and you are a one person operation, start writing things down today, okay? You need to be able to hand this to somebody else and have them help you out. And Karen just threw out that in her area that they have SCORE, and I talk about this all the time, S-C-O-R-E. SCORE is retired, people in business or some people who are still active in business want to give back to the business community. And in our area here in Lakeland, they have different classes that they sponsor and people come in and sometimes just for like $10 teach a class. Um, other times it's for free. You can go into and meet with the SCORE advisor and get some wonderful free mentorship. I encourage people all the time to not only seek resources in the balloon industry, but to support yourself by having systems in your city because when you're building those mentors in your city you're building your relationships that allow you to grow your business and we talked about that a lot last month with Lori Ann on our um, webinar for the Passport to Success for December. If you missed that and you're in my Passport to Success program already go back today and watch that replay okay and if you're not I'm going to show you ways that you can get hooked up and see that webinar if you'd like. So those are things that I really um, encourage you to look at. Um, John was telling me that he does SCORE also. That's awesome. Uh, question is, is SCORE available in the UK? And I'm going to be honest, I don't know that answer. So I would imagine that in the United Kingdom, there's got to be some kind of business associations that are there that you can get involved with. But what I'm gonna do is one of my instructors for promotions and profits this year is Stuart Davies from the UK, and I'm gonna message him as soon as we get off, and I'm gonna ask him that question of if they have any free services like that in the UK, and I will let you know. Um, Tiffany's also throwing that the Small Business Administration 
also offers a lot of courses and things that are available for you. So great. Love the extra tips and hints, guys. You're doing great. All right. So when we talk about having that support system for your business, I take these things to heart. Um, I just wrote an ebook that um, Mindy is proofing for me on the things that I wish I would have known when I started my balloon business. Because <laughs> there's a lot that I have learned since 2003 that if I were to open a balloon business today, I would do so much differently. And that is why I let you guys know the information that I share with you now is that I don't have the perfect plan, but I know how I would have done things differently now with all the resources that are available. So I want to introduce you to Mindy. Mindy is on my far left in the picture, and that was at the World Balloon Convention in San Diego. So when I'm out there telling you guys all the time to go to training and to invest in yourself, I do that. I still invest, and now instead of as a business owner, I go as a sponsor to World Balloon Convention and float and other workshops to help network with other balloon professionals and to continue growing my knowledge in the industry because I still go out and do balloons. Yesterday I was installing balloon drops and creating bubble strands and putting 300 balloons to the ceiling for two of our events for party people events. So I still am active in the industry. But what I want to let you know about is support systems. And Mindy Neal, she is the person who runs my world. <laughs> She is the one that I call my tech goddess, and she is the one that builds my website. She is the one that does my customer service management. Um, she is the one that helps and inspires me when I'm needing new technology and things for our industry. Um, I would not be where I am today with ballooncoach.com if it was not for Mindy. And Mindy has helped develop other people's websites and help um, us do different strategies. She is always behind the scenes helping us grow through Balloon Coach. So if you're one of those people that struggles with things on the internet and how to do your marketing, find someone that can be a mentor to you or that you can learn from or that can be a part of your team and help you. It makes such a difference. All right. So if you want 2019 or insert year that you watch this replay to be your year, don't sit on the couch and wait for it. Go out, make a change, smile more, be excited, do things, new things, do new things, throw away what you've been cluttering, unfollow negative people on social media, go to bed early, wake up early, be fierce, don't gossip, show more gratitude, do things that challenge you and be brave. Okay. I put this up on my news feed on balloon coach. So if you want it, go to balloon coach, Facebook page, the main page, and you can share from there anywhere you want. Um, all of these things, when I saw this online was like, this is perfect. These are the things that I want for 2019. And what I have learned is with my coaching program, when I'm working with people one-to-one -one, or when I'm working in group coaching through Balloon Boss Mastermind or when we're at Promotions and Profits having conversations, the number one thing that gets in people's way is they don't take action on the goals that they have. They let fear get in their way. They let those negative people in their life that say, you can't do that. You can't make it happen. They listen to that. And I want to share a quick story on this. My husband, Brian Giardina, that thank you guys for all of your prayers um, with all of his medical issues over the last year. Um, he is my rock. He is my support system. He is my husband, my partner in life, and I adore him. However, he and I have two different personalities. And when I told him that Promotions and Profits 2018 was going to sell out and I was going to have 75 balloon professionals there, he said, that's not going to happen. He goes, you've not, you're not going to have that many people pay that much money to come to that experience. Okay. This is my husband. This is my best support. This is the man I live with. And he's telling me that's not going to happen. <laughs> I could do one of two things. I could either believe him and then just go, yeah, it's not going to happen. There's no way. Or instead I can use it as a challenge. I'm going to prove you wrong. I'm going to show you what I can do. I'm going to show you that what I'm creating is what other people need. And you know what? He loves that I proved him wrong. Now, you know, as a man, they don't always want you to prove them wrong. But in this case, 
he is glad that his um, not being optimistic helps me even be more motivated to prove him wrong. So I wanted to let you know that even me, that is cheery and upbeat all the time, I have those people that are in my life that are naysayers and say, you can't do this. My dad totally did not understand the balloon industry. He didn't understand my business model. He did not understand why people would pay for balloons, but that did not slow me down, okay? So number three, to help your balloon business dreams come true this next year is take action daily, okay? Write it down, take action daily. Just like the previous um, slide said, get off your couch. You gotta get away from your desk. You gotta get away from your computer and you have to get out in life and take action daily. Life is a series of learning experience. It's okay to fail, to stumble, and we grow from the experience that that action creates, okay? So let me make sure I say that again. Life is a series of learning experience. It's okay to fail, to stumble, and then grow from the experience that that action creates. So many times people tell me that they are afraid to fail, and thus they do nothing. Dudes, if I would have been fearful and not taken action, Balloon Coach would not exist. We would not have just had that amazing retreat in Orlando. I would not be at a position to help guide you and support you in your journey in the balloon industry. Um, we wouldn't have um, the amazing balloon decor that we have here in Lakeland. <laughs> um, I went out and I took action and I went to conventions early on back when I started in the industry in 2003. And then I brought back what I learned and then I went out and told people what I could do for them and I educated them. But I had to do that face to face. Okay. So creating beautiful balloon decor and moments like this, if that's what you dream for your balloon business. You can make it a reality. You just have to invest in yourself and in the time that you put into your business and go take action daily. Fill your life with people who inspire and lift you up. You deserve to create the life you dream of, okay? So let's talk about some of those people that lift us up and inspire us. This is Jonathan Gerber on the left and Katie Byrne on the right. These two were dynamic instructors for me at Promotions and Profits. But outside of that, I knew them way before then. Jonathan is the guy that I hung out with and knew through the balloon industry. He was an entertainer many years ago. He started in the balloon industry as an entertainer and was a manager for that balloon entertainment company. And then he bought it. And then he said, you know what? I kind of like this decor thing. And he bought a decor company. And I watched him as he bought that company and how he developed his team. And from there, I sold him my company. <laughs> and since that, we've bought other companies. It's exciting to watch Jonathan grow his dream. The reason he and Katie are in this photo together is they're holding an images magazine by Qualitex and the last printed version that just came out, because um, they're now gonna go to an online version instead, the last free printed version that came out they had best of the best and they were highlighting people who did organic decor. And the top picture on the right, uh, right in front of Katie, that is an organic install that she did that is just phenomenal. And then underneath that is an organic install that Jonathan and Party People Events did for a um, cosmetics company um, at the convention center, here, convention center here in Orlando. So the reason I share this picture is when we look on Facebook and when we read our images magazines. We see all this amazing decor and so many times we say, oh, I can't do that. I'll never find a client. And you're right. If you feel that way, that you'll never find a client that will buy that, you won't. But if instead you look at that and go, wow, if Jonathan's doing that. And if Katie's doing that, then I can sell it too. They're standing in front of the beautiful organic wall that they built at Promotions and Profits. And it was so cool to be able to sit down and have people hang out with them during lunches just to be able to talk about business and strategies and success. So get support in your journey. 
pick a mentor, find a coach, and surround yourself with positive, like-minded people, it makes a world of difference, okay? It doesn't have to be just through ballooncoach.com. In fact, I don't want it to be. Yes, I want you to be a part of as much of ballooncoach.com as you want to be. We have support systems that I can be there for you every single day. But I also want you to have mentors and people that you aspire to be like outside of the balloon industry. Because in your own town where you live, there are businesses that are excelling and you want to hang out with them. Become involved in some business organization so that you can be around awesome people on a regular basis. And it can be just business people. It doesn't have to even be in the events industry. But then also if you're in an area that has an events industry and you can network with other florists and event planners, catering companies and all that, those kind of support systems are crucial in being around awesome people that can motivate you. So this was my family way back when. Back in 2004, it was our first castle and our daughter, when I did this graphic was 18, she's now 19. Um, so way back when, 2004 castle, and yes, I can see the frame showing through, but hey, it was an awesome event when you were there in person. And then my husband and my daughter and I, at December 31st of 2014, when we were installing balloons to the ceiling, and it's the same job that I did yesterday in 2018. My family is a dynamic support for me. They were the ones who helped me build my business. <laughs> um, in my backyard, I built a 600 square foot warehouse, which is behind the trailer. And then over the years, I went from a 10 foot trailer to buying this custom trailer that was 12 feet long with um, an arrow at the front. Just if you guys are looking for a trailer, when you have that arrow in the front, it's really nice because it makes it easier on turns or backing it up. And then my um, van, that was a dream of mine. When I first started, we had a minivan and I had a 10 foot trailer that I bought from the other company. Over time, my business grew so that I could have that van and I could have that trailer and fill them both with balloons. And that we built the 600 square foot warehouse in our backyard and we filled it with balloons. All of those dreams came true because I wrote it down. And then this is my daughter, Marley. She's now 19. That's her boyfriend, Steven, in the picture. They were both with us at retreat. And if you don't have family members that are supportive of you, you're not the only one. Like I told you, there's times that Brian's not so thrilled about balloons or he has his doubts on things. But then surround yourself by other friends and business leaders that do have your positive mindset and hang out with them. So I want to let you know about a couple of resources and then I'm going to answer your guys' questions that I see popping up. Balloon Coach resources are made for you. I have a free blog that I update on a weekly basis. I have past issues of elevated events, which is great testimonials of success from other balloon professionals from around the world. I stopped doing that and started focusing more on my blog, but all those past issues are there. And there are great interviews with Chris Adamo and um, Tommy and Scott DeLorenzo, and a lot of entertainers are in there too, Carolyn Heyman with Conrad. So go back on to ballooncoach.com, click elevated events and do some reading, get motivated and inspired. I have Balloon Boss Mastermind, and this gives you access to support on a daily basis. My Balloon Boss Mastermind is my group coaching program. So for just $97 a month, you can hang out and get all of my past training on all my past webinars, and then have access to other training that's specific to our Balloon Boss Mastermind group. We have a private group where we hang out and share our struggles and our successes, and that is the way for me to help the most people out because I had many telling me that with my one-to-one -one coaching of $225 a month, that that wasn't in their budget. So by doing this group coaching plan of the Balloon Boss Mastermind, it's a way for me to help more people out at once and to let you have a network of people that you can support. Promotions and Profits Retreat 2019. The early bird sign up gets you the best rate and access to bonus online training that's going to be January 6th and June 2nd. So that's the online bonus training. You don't have to pay for retreat in full, but that's the best value. If you divide it up into payments, it's just 109 and some change a month for 10 months. And if you register this week, 
you will be in the January 6th online free class for three hours. Yep, this Sunday, January 6th from 5 to 8 p.m. Eastern, I will be online doing three hours of a worksheet for you to use for goal setting. I will do information on how to create your own vision board. And I will also work on a marketing plan where you will have worksheets that you can go back. If you're not able to join us live, it's okay because you'll be able to go back and watch the replay later because that's the great thing about being a part of any of our balloon coach programs is our replays of anything that you purchase stays there for you. All right. And then monthly inspiration via passport to success monthly webinars. It's the fourth Tuesday of the month for just $25 a month where you get to hear from business professionals and balloon industry leaders to help you grow your business. If you have questions, cause we have so much that we offer, email Joette, J-O-E-T-T-E -E, at ballooncoach.com if you want to have a 10 minute free consultation to see what program may be the best fit for you. I want to help you be inspired for being fierce in this next year. And December 2018, our Passport to Success webinar was Be Fierce by Lorianne Cicerelli. She is an attorney here in Lakeland. She's a part of my professional business network, American Business Women's Association group that I was um, involved with for many years. And she is a dynamo who inspires me on a daily basis just following her Facebook feed. If you are a Passport to Success member or Bloom Boss Mastermind currently and you missed the webinar, go back and watch that replay today to get inspired and talk about networking in your community. Go listen to that. Put it on while you're um, watching TV, doing laundry, not watching TV, while you're doing laundry, doing dishes, hanging out at your desk, driving to the car to your kids to school or events, listen to those replays. And if you're not a part of Passport to Success yet, you can purchase it individually or Best value, Balloon Boss Mastermind for just $97 a month. Um, while you're an active member, you have access to over $2,500 worth of training. So that's our best value. And you can just binge watch for a month if you want and then cancel your subscription and then you'll lose access. Or you can stay in the program for as long as you want to help have that daily um, inspiration from our online group. This is the year I will be stronger, braver, kinder, unstoppable, and this year, I will be fierce. I hope that can be your mantra. It's mine for this year. I borrowed it from Lori Ann because it was on her Facebook feed. And this is what I'm talking about. These are the kind of people that I follow on Facebook. People who are going to put things out that inspire me and make me want to go for my goals. So, Join us for our annual live event, Promotions and Profits Retreat in Orlando 2019. This is my invitation to you. No matter where you live in the world, we would love for you to fly into Orlando International Airport and join us for a week of learning, five days of training, different than anything else you find in the industry. I've hired two business consultants to be with us to help us on our business strategy and help us in taking care of ourselves, reducing our stress, and learning about our communication styles and how we communicate with our staff, our families, and our clients for us to have more success. When you come to Promotions and Profits Retreat, you surround yourself with like-minded people. You get hands-on learning through dynamic group builds. I have not announced what that group build is yet because I'm waiting on a few details to be finalized, but it's gonna be awesome. Um, Stuart Davies from the UK, who's known for his big um, balloon builds, is going to be um, a lead for that event and one of our instructors. And Chris Potts from Buffalo, um, New York, will also be on our team, along with a lot of other dynamic instructors that have been on our team in the past. Check them all out at ballooncoach.com Orlando Retreat. Again, if you sign up now, you will be able to be a part of our January 6th and June 2nd online classes to help you have success this year before getting to retreat. We'll have workshops for you to focus on your goals, a checklist for marketing, and steps to create your vision for 2019 to make it the best year yet. And for those of you who are interested, I'll also give you a guide on how to make your vision board. Go to ballooncoach.com, click on Orlando Retreat to see all the details and get it for half price rate, early bird bonus, if you're watching this replay before that deadline. And you also can just see how the pricing structure works throughout this next year. I would love for you to join us on Facebook for business conversation 
at Balloon Coach Community. So that's on Facebook.com groups, Balloon Coach Community. If you're not a part of that group yet, I'd love for you to be. And here's the kind of things that I like to have in our Balloon Coach Community. I love for you to share photos of your work and then tell me how you got that job. Like, here's our New Year's Eve job that we just did at the local yacht club. And the way that we got that job was I uh, met the event marketing manager at a networking event and we sold them the idea or I cold called them and got the job or I walked in and I got it or I sent them an email. Balloon Coach Community on Facebook is a way to share our successes and our struggles and help each other grow our business. And I'd love for you to be a part of that. And then if you want that next step of extra support and services with ballooncoach.com, check out the website today, find out which program works for you. And if you need that consultation with me, email joette at ballooncoach.com and I'll set up a 10 minute consultation to see what resources are best for you. And it might not be me. I might tell you to go to some other convention. I may tell you to go to a business coach locally with your score that's totally free. When you talk to me, I'm not always about just selling my services. I'm about letting you know the other supports that are available for you. I may refer you to a free blog that I wrote that tells you the websites to go to to get those free services in your area. So again, if you want that free consult, just email me, joette at ballooncoach.com. To end the webinar today, before I um, go into questions, I just wanted to show you some of the wonderful people that were at Promotions and Profits with me this year. On the far left, our wall of the 2019, that was half of the organic wall created in Katie Burns' class. And then we broke it in half for our New Year's Eve celebration and Jonathan Gerber ran this beautiful lighting through it. And um, James is in the front there with a group of lovely folks just having a good time. Myself in front of the class teaching, our hands on bill for the organics class. Gail and her husband, whose businesses has soared after coming to two of our promotions events. And then Cece from the Bahamas there doing a selfie with us. Um, hey, Will, I see your jacket there in the photo. I love our hands-on events because it allows me to meet people. And this next year, I even have an event planner that will be at the event with us to help make it spectacular. And... Um, so people are asking me some questions and what I'm going to do is pull things up so I can answer them. So the first one that I'm seeing is how much is Orlando five days? So the five day program currently is on sale for half price. And when you go to ballooncoach.com and click on Orlando retreat, you just page down and it tells you about promotions and profits. It lets you meet all of our staff. There are currently sign up. We will have more in 2019. I'm excited about that because um, we have other manufacturers who will be announcing who they are sponsoring. This tells you more about our bonus program, uh, the class that's coming up this um, on the 6th. And this bonus class is for those people coming to retreat. Um, so if you sign up now, the price is $9.99. If you wait until September, if we still have spots available, um, it will be $19.99. So right now when you sign up, you are saving $1,000. And um, so you can choose a three payment plan, a six payment plan, or a 10 month payment plan. And what happens if you go for a payment plan is you buy today, January 1st, and then the first of each month, you will be deducted the $109.89 the next 10 months. Um, or if you want to go ahead and not have to do that 10% um, service fee on the payment plans, you can just do $9.99 today and pay it all at once. Know that it's taken care of and then get your $599 of online training for free, a nice extra bonus. So no matter if you pick a payment plan or the regular um, all in full, you will be a part of the class. All right. So let me go ahead and see what other questions we have going on. All right, Francesca's saying good webinar. Thank you, glad that you enjoyed it. Um, all right, so Cynthia said that she loves that word fierce. I do too, isn't it empowering? So I hope that you will take the things that we talked about today to be fierce in 2019 or beyond, depending on when you're watching this. Um, are there any podcasts on balloon business anyone that can recommend? Yes, there are, and I can send that to you. So send me a private message, um, and I will be glad to send that to you. All right, 
Um, let's see, I'm reading down. All oh, right, Jacqueline is saying that her van will arrive this January, um, that she will brand to build awareness for her business. That is awesome. One of the best things that I ever did with my vehicle was put up the vinyl on it. And even though I didn't fully wrap my vehicle, just having my website and my phone number was a game changer. I would be sitting in the parking lot of a um, grocery store and I actually had somebody call me and said, I don't want to freak you out. I'm not stalking you, but I just happened to be parked next to you. And I saw your um, logo and I need balloons for my wife's birthday party. <laughs> so it works. And then the other thing I did is I put the logo on my husband's car also. Now I want to just tell you because I used to sell insurance at one point is when you go to put logos on your vehicles, it's now for business purposes. You need to make sure you're insured correctly for that. So that if you get an accident, you're covered. So, but what I did is I had the logo on both my van, the trailer and my husband's car because he would use it often for business also. And it was great because he traveled to Bartow every day as a teacher and I travel in Lakeland doing my jobs. And now it looks like we have this fleet of cars out there. It was great. But again, if you do put your logo on vehicles, please make sure that it's covered under your insurance, either having commercial insurance or under your personal insurance that you have it listed that you are um, using it for business um, use. And so, yeah, Karen saying that she put vinyl on her van using her silhouette cameo. Again, just make sure that it's listed. Um, all right. And Will, you've got some great questions about the feathers and um, the retreat information on the um, photos. I will send you an email with all of those details. All right. And um, a question is being asked of what kind of balloons will we teach at the Orlando five day class? Um, those details <laughs> will be um, forthcoming. Um, but the bottom line is with the balloon decor that we're creating, we have Chris Potts, who is excellent at outdoor balloon decor. So he's going to be talking about how to create structures that are sound so that you have really good base plates and uprights that can support different things, whether it's going to be indoors or outdoors. And um, the exact balloons that we will be creating um, will, is yet to be announced. But what I guarantee you is every piece of balloon decor we create the reason we do it is so that you have beautiful photos to then sell that decor when you get home. And with promotions and profits, we are more about creating sellable decor that makes you lots of money than creating the most difficult type of design. So the designs that we focus on are things that are highly profitable, that are things that you can train your staff to do if you're building your team, and that can take an awesome photo to be in high demand afterwards. All right. Robin, you're welcome about knowing about the insurance. <laughs> All right. So guys, um, one of the questions that came up was, can you explain operations manuals? Because that was one of our tips, right? When I talked about building your team and your supports. So just one second, let me get a drink. When you build an operations manual, think about any time that you've had a job in the past. Like, did you used to work at McDonald's? Did you work for some other company? And when you got there, they gave you a manual, like here's your job description and what you're responsible for doing. And then it gave you a list of duties. Um, and then like with me, I worked for Geico Insurance at one point um, and before I owned my balloon business. And when I worked for Geico, it was very specific of this is my script. It's what I have to say when I answer the phone. And then it's the steps of how that phone conversation goes. And at Geico, you're working on a computer as you take the call. And it was step by step what you said. So what happened for me is it helped me develop the script that I use in Balloon Boss Mastermind to help people when the phone rings. Um, within the Decor 101 program that's a part of Balloon Boss Mastermind, I talk about when you talk to a client on the phone, you want to have a system that's consistent that you do every single time. And it's asking for important information like the location, the date, the theme, and so many other questions that we need to have. If you create something that's written that you do step by step, now nothing gets missed. What happens is so many of us just grab a scratch piece of paper and write down what the people will need. And we ask as many questions as we think of, but you might be distracted because you might be on an event blowing up balloons. So if you actually make a form 
that you either have on your computer or that you print off and write on and have exact questions that you ask every single time somebody calls you for a quote or that you have a form on your website that your contacts fill out that has all the information you need, that's the system. And then as you make your operations manual for your business, Adam, for you, it might be how to make sand weights. I've been to Adam's business down in South Florida uh, when I went down to hang out and do a Florida balloon jam one time. And um, in South Florida, it was a lot of fun. So Adam, in your space, it could be even um, as picky or as detailed as when you open up the warehouse door, the lights are on the left-hand side, turn the switch on. Um, it could be, you know, how where you should plug the fans in. It might be um, safety precautions when you're using your foam cutter. Anything that you would want your staff to know and tips to follow to make their lives better. Because here's what happens. I talk about this a lot and there's a blog that I wrote on it and I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can pull it up real quick because I think this is something for you to think about if you've never thought about that you need a support system and have other staff work for you in the future is when you go onto my blog, you just keep paging down. As you can see, there's lots of entries. All right, and so here it is. What happens to your balloon business if your family members has a medical emergency? Where does that come from? Joette spent January with my dad passing away, <laughs> and then my husband had four stays in the hospital in 2018. And during one of his stays, I wrote this blog. <laughs> because my mind is always thinking about the other people that I work with in the balloon industry. And I think, are you guys prepared? Are you ready for this? And unfortunately, over the years, I've had several friends in the industry have skiing accidents. And um, they've had to think about this, who's running their business for them and what steps are created. And one of those people that I really um, respect is Diana Gladden out of Knoxville, Tennessee. She had a skiing injury and she had already built systems for her company, but she knew that she needed more. And so she wrote tons of great material that her staff now follow as systems. So if you haven't read this blog yet, go in and check it out because it gives you some things to think about of why you would need to write things down of how are your clients gonna get taken care of if you're not available to be there. So anything that you write, anything that you do, to make your business happen can be written down and made into a procedure. I hope that makes sense. All right, guys. Well, I want to just check and see if there's anybody that has any other questions about the three steps to growing your balloon business. Write down your goals, get a support system, and you will have an amazing year. Okay? If there are things that I can do to help you out, send me an email, send me a private message. I would love to help you out with that. Thank you guys so much for being with me today. If you have any questions about ballooncoach.com and the services that we offer, I'd love for you to be a part of our team, a part of our programs. We have a lot of fun together. Just go to ballooncoach.com and right here is a video that gives you some overviews about our programs and then you can check out all the different things that we talked about today. So um, what I'm going to do is um, say thank you for being a part of today's webinar, and I can't wait to help you make 2019 and beyond amazing. This is a great time to be in the balloon industry, and I'm so glad that you chose to be a part of today's class. Have a great day.